This world is And I know what I'm searching for. So I'll set sail for the horizon. And the great big world beyond. I see the world! What? I'm going to leave Rippletide and become a traveling merchant. I'll see the world and have customers from every corner of the realm. Oh, my. Traveling merchant? I... You need at least two more years of stocking the store. And... That's five years before you're ready to go anyway. Sorry, Pa. Besides, I'll get all kinds of training. <sighs> There's no point in trying to stop you now, Tra Oh! Darn! I know. But I had a feeling this day would come. In the end, being a good merchant boils down to experience. Go and see the world, Tressa. I understand. Do take care of yourself. Be strong and make... And... But I'll come back one day. We wouldn't know what to do if you didn't. <laughs> uh. Bye, Mom! Bye, Mom! This journal? The author only built... The other half is still blank. Guess I'll just have to pick up work. I'll write down everything. From the next chapter on, I'll travel far and wide. I don't know what lies behind. There's only one way to find out. See ya, Rippletide! My adventures as a merchant are just beginning. I'll start by following in the footsteps of a nameless traveler. And journey far, far beyond!
is truly <laughs> With each 
battle, I grow stronger. Shall be mine. The battle is. Let's do it. You got more than you bargained for. Now, then. 
battle. <laughs> With each battle, I grow stronger. How fair they. And thus. Hello. Hello there. And so it was that Atlas Dam was founded some two centuries ago. Indeed, our fair city-state is among the longest standing on the continent of Austera. But there was another city-state with a history as long and proud as our own that came to a tragic ruin only eight short years ago. Now, who can tell me its name? How about you, Therese? <laughs> I, um, I... Now, now. No need to get all fluffed. There's no shame in not knowing an answer, so long as you have... The answer is in your textbook. Yes. It was Sornberg. That is correct. Hornberg was ruled over by a royal family 
said to be descended from priests of an ancient and long-forgotten religion. On the other hand, our fair Atlas Dam was founded by one of the original clans that inhabited the Flatlands. Who can tell me how many clans lived in the Flatlands at the time? The histories have it that eight clans did live in the Flatlands in those days. Correct you are, Your Highness. It was a time of great strife here in the Flatlands, as the eight clans waged a long and bitter war. Change would come when the armies of Grandport invaded these lands. At the time, the rulers of Grandport sought to exert their influence over... Ironically, this compelled the warring tribes to put aside their... Oh! But look at the time. Uh, we'll pick up where we left off next time. Don't forget to read chapters 3 and 4 before our next lecture. And be prepared to answer questions on any of the material within. Yes, Professor. Thank you for another most stimulating lecture, Professor Albright. Hello? Splendid! The truth of the matter is... But of course! Mm-hmm! of you. Pleasure. I thank you. Indeed. Day. Farewell. Ah, Therese. Yes, 
you have a question for? No. Hello. Hello. 